Hello everybody, welcome back to another Mid Journey version 5 tutorial. In this one, I'm going to show you how to create one prompt, and with that one prompt, you can create 40 variations, not four, 40 variations from that one prompt. And not only that, I'm going to show you how to make it so that they're all wildly different. So they're completely different. There's tons of different options and things you may not have thought about. They're going to show up in these variations through the chaos feature or the chaos functionality. So let's get right into this. The first step is I'm going to go forward slash imagine as we do. And then I'm just going to write something very basic. So cute bulldog is what I've decided on. And the reason why is if you go very narrow, you may not see all of the variations and different styles. So keep that in the back of your head. So um, cute bulldog, it's very, very general term. Now, the next step is we're going to introduce chaos. So yeah, we're going <laughs> to... We're going to have a dash dash chaos like I just typed in there. And then I'm going to go space 100. That is the maximum amount of the chaos feature or functionality you can put in Mid Journey version 5 as of this time. So this is basically telling Mid Journey, I want you to go crazy and try out all the different styles, no restrictions, go nuts. So we've got a chaos value of 100. I'm going to hit space bar and then I'm going to go dash dash repeat. 10. This is currently the maximum number of repeats that you can have on Mid Journey version 5. This may change in the future. What repeat 10 does is it says, look, run this prompt with maximum chaos, but run it 10 times. So we're not going to get a group of, we're not going to get a two by two grid, uh, one grid. We're going to get 10 separate grids and they're all going to have the chaos, the maximum chaos applied to it. So with that explanation out of the way, I'm going to hit enter. And then when we come back, I'm going to show you what we got and we'll wrap it all up. All right, everybody, welcome back. So just keep in mind that you have to click on the green box to agree to this, uh, to run it 10 times. The reason why is this can use a lot of your fast hours. Uh, so it can chew through some of your, <laughs> some of your GPU time. So keep that in the back of your head. Anyways, it did 10 it repeated it, so it did 40 variations of this single prompt, cute bulldog. Let's look at them. Awesome. Puppy dog, French bulldog, English bulldog, puppy, a little bit of a mix here with some pretty ears. I mean, it just goes nuts. We got this little one here in this little red riding hood type suit. Like, just absolute mush ball. But they're all completely different styles, right? It's very, I mean, obviously they've got different types of bulldogs in here. Mid Journey has done an incredible job coming up with ideas and it ran them 10 times look at this little guy in his little crate i mean this just yeah as i i obviously have a bulldog uh so yeah i get to turn into a bit of a mush ball here this is a french bulldog with english bulldog markings what the heck's going on down there uh anyways i also ran it again a second time with another prompt here look at this i have walking mech robot with hexagonal weapons Walking in a cyberpunk wasteland, Chaos 100, repeat 10. The reason why I did this is because I wanted to show you what it would look like with a more specific prompt. And again, Mid Journey does not disappoint. These are completely different styles. The Chaos uh, is totally working here. I mean, these are just all fantastic. Look at this. Look at these top two. Holy smokes. So you can really get a bunch of really great ideas and get a whole bunch of variations all with one prompt in one click of the enter button. There you go, guys. Thanks for watching. I got a ton more stuff coming up. Stay tuned.